Here at Clackamas Community College, many athletes find the training facilities extremely cluttered and inconvenient. Though opinions may vary and some student athletes disagree with this topic, we took a deeper look into the subject of the athletic facilities here at CCC and asked athletes and coaches about their opinions. Yes, I am an athlete and I wrestle. The sports facilities here at CCC are adequate. They work. Uh, but there's too much risk involved with uh, the space and having too many athletes in a confined space. My name is Josh Roden. I'm the head wrestling coach and health PE instructor here at the college. Teach personal health, uh, some of our weight training and fitness courses. You know, I think some of them, uh, for the most part, are a little bit uh, old and, and in many ways inadequate for all of our teams. Uh, that's not just the wrestling program. As a wrestling coach, obviously my obligation is to our, our team, but on a larger scheme, uh, our athletics department, because what's good for all of us is going to be better, uh, more adequate facilities. My name is Megan. I play volleyball here at CCC. I like the sporting facilities here. They're nice. The gym's really nice. has a good floor. Um, and then the workout facility, we have a lot of equipment, so that's nice. Beyond their opinions, we also asked what athletes and coaches thought the best way we could upgrade. They could be better by uh, increasing the size of the weight room, increasing the size of the training room, and me personally, they can uh, increase the size of the wrestling room so there's less injury in there. No, I don't think that there's anything really that needs to be changed. Um, we could get some new volleyball stuff, but that, that's not really facility-wise, that, that's more equipment. As far as problems with the facilities, uh, you know, obviously scheduling is the first thing that I think of, whether it's classes that are in here throughout the day or it's you know, trying to schedule different athletic events for Jim, our athletic director, and the people who want to rent our facility. Um, the other things I think of are things like injuries, especially for the wrestling program. Uh, we're in a small space. We've got lots of big guys, athletic guys, that are using up a lot of space, covering a lot of ground when they're wrestling. Um, and we've had several knee, shoulder, ankle injuries as a result of just lack of facility space. So um, obviously those are a huge concern for us. The only time I've experienced that is during um like some hours of the day when we're when there's people working out some of the machines get pretty filled with people because like if there's wrestlers working out and basketball like they kind of get over stocked in there and no one can really work out until they're done but if you decide a good time to work out then it's pretty nice some student athletes have certain issues due to the needed upgrades in the sporting facilities uh, so things like you know continuing uh, to upgrade our weight room uh, has been awesome for our guys. Uh, if we could get expanded facilities for our outdoor sports uh, in the spring, who share the the basketball court, for example, getting them a field house that they could uh, work out in um, would be awesome for them, I'm sure. So that basketball and, and volleyball and those things could get practice times that are at times that they don't want that they'd like to have rather than in the evenings.